These are some serious beef up beaters to come after you, Jackie. They don't make like the Wall Street. You're just a low-life punk, Swifty. Who the fuck put you up to this? You, you think I wanted to mess with you? Come on, I, I had no choice. You stubborn prick. Are you even listening to what I'm saying? Envelope with a whole load of cash in it. Their boss, their, their leader, whatever. I, I, I met him in a brothel, the, the Brimstone Club. All right. Look, I'm telling you, th these guys are some kind of. Hey, what the fuck are you doing? Damn it! You of a <laughs> what the fuck did you do? I needed him. I needed him. Was nothing. Once the darkness gets a hold of you, you start to lose control. You start to wonder what the fuck you're doing. Time slips away from you. And then, all of a sudden, it's like you're sitting in a theater, watching a movie of your own life. And you're up there on the big screen, big as life. You're a fucking movie star, and you're killing all the bad guys, tearing them limb from limb. And you feel good, you look good. Fuck, you are good. And then you realize something. Everyone else in the theater, they're screaming. 
because they're watching a horror movie. And you're not the hero. You're the monster. Eddie and Frank are checking out the Brimstone right now. And the new guys found your buddy, Johnny Powell. Yeah, he didn't take to your invitation so good. We put him in the back room so he could shit his pants for a while. Follow me. Can't wait to see him again. Yeah, it's me. This guy's a couple clowns short of a circus, Jackie. He wasn't living by the Queensboro Bridge. He was living under it, in a cardboard box. All right, come on. He's back here. Hey, Chief, how's the wife and kids? Mm. Well, he's in a good mood. There you go. Knock yourself out. So let's say you live in a big house and you own some books. I mean, some other fuck nuts might live at the North Pole near... Johnny Powell. You look like shit. You were supposed to be the expert. I paid you good money to help me figure things out, and you repaid me by skipping out in the middle of the night? For what? Jackie, I did what I could to help you control the darkness. But being around you was becoming a problem for me. The darkness is so fucking seductive. I could hear it whispering to me whenever I was around you. It was starting to change me. Are you gonna kill me? Is that what this is all about? I let it out, Johnny. Now I don't know if I can control it. Let the darkness back out? Jesus Christ, Jackie, that thing is like a slow suicide. Then help me get it back under control. You don't control the darkness, Jackie. You cower in fucking fear of it, and you pray it goes away. The longer the darkness is active, the more it'll try to confuse you. <laughs> it'll try to trap you, make you see stuff that, 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 that other people can't see. I need your help, so you're back on the payroll until I say you can go. A bunch of assholes just came after my entire operation. And whoever gave them this envelope is connected to the darkness somehow. I need you to figure out who they are and what they know about it. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, I, I, I'll do what I can. It's, it'll go a lot faster if you get one of your gorillas to untie me. Please? It lives in Viscera. And you are the focus. It wants chaos. Life gives you lemons. You even give me lemonade. Don't make no difference if it's kiwi fruit. It's better than sleeping under a piece of wet cardboard. So don't fuck it up. Gotta get organized. Look at all these damn books they got. Don't, 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 don't be an idiot, Johnny. All right? They're, they're giving you an opportunity. All right? Don't, 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 don't. Look. You can untie him now, Chief. But keep an eye on him for me, would you? Hmm. Wow, that guy really let himself go. I used to think he was pretty smart. Now he looks like something the cat threw up. Hey, hey, Frank and Eddie are back from the club. They're waiting for you with Jimmy in your office. All right, thanks, Vin. Don't you listen to that voice in your head, Jackie. You fear the darkness like it was the devil himself. Everything exists. How are you holding up, Jackie? I'm all right, Aunt Sarah. How you doing? I have arthritis and two bum knees. Every day is a gift. How do you think I'm doing? You're something else, you know that? And you look like shit, you know that? I'm gonna make... You're the best. Bet your ass I am. <laughs>